Okay, guys, this is a game I've actually been pretty excited for. So this game's called Wrenched. It's a wrench. It's a car building game. Um, now I played the demo for this, and they had a pretty late release for it. It's supposed to come back out in February. Come out back in February. English would be nice, but it just came out literally like a day or two ago. So I'm super pumped to play it. I know a little bit of what's going on, but apparently they added a lot of new stuff. So we're just gonna start a new game. Ooh, there's a paint sprayer now. Oh, sick. I didn't even know that. Okay, but anyway, so basically this game is like the advanced Legos, right? So it's super hands-on, and you'll see how detailed it is. It's really cool. So uh, back. So let's see if I remember how to move. I think it's, yeah, okay. Ooh, whoa, 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 a little too close. little too close. So we're going to take that off. Okay, so we have to build this bish. All right, so. Install the brackets. It's also very hard when you don't have a picture to go with it. Okay, now I remember how to do this now. So you scan one item, and what it'll do is it'll actually show uh, on here how to build it. So install info. So there you go. Once you scan something, it'll tell you all the parts. So there's the screws, blah, blah, blah. There we go. Now. That goes in there. Nice. So we're literally building our garage right now, which is not <laughs> easy by any means, but okay. So let's put let's put this up in the air like that. Let's stick that one. Oh, it's probably the other side. Yeah. Boom. Like that. Now, here comes the next part that's pretty hard. So one thing that they added. Oh, that's the oil pan. I thought it was something else. Never mind. Because the hardest part of this game is keeping track of your bolts, which kind of, kind of sucks a little bit. But let's see. What's what's that? I don't even know what the hell. Okay. Whatever. Bracket one. Eh. Bracket. I, I don't even know what that is yet. So come on. Let me grab you. There we go. Eh. That can get installed there. This can get installed here. Now, I'm not going to lie. It can be confusing at first, but it's not that big of a deal. It just takes a little getting used to. I'm probably going to end up changing the movement, but okay. So we got screw number one. Bolt. Bolt. What is my dog barking at? Bolt. Okay. So now what I could do is I could turn the table with my superhuman strength obviously like this forearm these forearm muscles guys as you can see in incredible now what's pretty cool whoa geez calm down over select there. the ratchet or impact yep. tool from the two so from inventory. here i kind of know what we're doing ratchets picked up from a distance snap to a default orientation in your hand grabbing yep. a ratchet up close allows for holding it at a custom angle so the trigger operates okay the calm down over there okay so these things are pretty cool so there's different types of wrenches i usually use this one so this is the small one and what you could do is you can tighten like this or if you press this it's electric and then you can also control how much torque you want and sometimes some things let's oh, why you watch this boom some things will actually tell you how much torque it needs i'm just going to electrically do all these because i can and based on, so if I use this one, it's going to go a little faster, which is pretty awesome. Do you need this much torque for a screw? Honestly, I couldn't tell you, but I'm going to assume no. Now, what do we do? Where's the install info? I need my scanner because I'm actually not even sure where this thing goes. Oh, okay. So it just slides into place like that? Oh, oh, it's on the other side. Gotcha. Eh? Eh, that shit there. Boom. Perfect. Oh, Begin here we by go. Installing the oil squirters and block side bearings. Do not forget the two thrust bearings. When these parts are installed, lower the crankshaft into the block. Install bearings into main bearing caps and then slide them into place. Yeah. Install the main bearing cap bolts to finish this assembly phase. Okay. Now, this was basically the demo. Um, it's not as rigorous, like there's a little bit more to the demo, but basically you're building an engine here. So I don't completely remember how to do it in the sense of 
Like, I need the instructions. It's not like I had this shit memorized, guys. Okay. So, here's our thing. We got to put... Why is it not staying in air? Oh, it doesn't stay in air anymore. So, we got to flip it this way. We got to get... This is... It's very hard to see in there. So, what I like to do... Flashlight, just so I can see. So... I gotta spin this bad boy around. See, it's like a puzzle. And I'm pretty good with puzzles. Sort of. Two. Three. Four. Nice. Okay, so now. The screws. One. Two. Three. Four. Sweet. Now we torque these bad boys in. So, first part done. Now, I do wish it was kind of like Legos in the sense of like, oh, let's just give you all the directions. But instead, what you have to do, which is a little tedious, is you have to literally search the part and I'll tell you where everything goes. So, like for instance, this didn't work the first time, right? So now I'll do that and then it'll tell me like what goes where, things like that, and I'll give you all these parts. So, the next thing that we have to do is we have to mount these parts into here. Is it that easy? Hopefully. You never know. Like, well, I don't even know what the hell these are. So, what do I do? Boom. Scan. Trust bearings. Okay. So, these two go in the back. These are two special ones, I guess. Hmm. Okay. Well, we'll figure it out. Ready? One, two, three, four, five. Nice. One. Oh. Sometimes you just gotta force it. There we go. So now we crank that shaft, right? We put this in. Nice, nice. Now all these go over. Oh, well, I guess it probably wants me to put them in this way. Yeah. So one, two, and three, four, and oh, tits. Up oh, tits. Okay. Five. All right. So one. It doesn't matter. Oh, no. Nice. Doesn't matter which one or what order you put them in. You just kind of send it for the boys. Oh, fuck. So now we put our screws in. Nice. Install. Oh, install info. Front. Okay, so I need a torque of 57 Newmans. So I'll put this to 57. Booyah! Install the rear main seal holder, oil pump, rear main seal, and front so main seal. That's this, I believe. Where is my trusty tablet? If here's the... So we gotta put this... Uh, so it's going on here. Yeah. Okay. So let me check something here. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. So this is going on first. Let's see if I can, could I put it on this way? Yeah. Nice. Then it goes on like this if i can get it other side maybe i don't know uh. oh oh it is okay hmm. okay we're good we're good no pa don't panic so now we put this like this we get our bolts right we just gotta boom 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 Nice. 
Nice and nice. Next thing we might as well do while we're here, we gotta do these little back plate. So nice. We grab this, we put it on that one. Yep. Boom. 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 Okay, we're good. And this one goes on here. Nice. Oh, I see what it's saying. So, two things we gotta do here. We have to get these onto here. Bracket. So let's let's start with these. Basically, we just have to put that in that. It's already pretty laid out for us. So we'll start there. We're clearly gonna have to connect those like this. So these are gonna go on here. One, oop. One, two, and three. This is gonna go into here. Oh, and go into here like. Nope. Like this. See, it's not gonna stay. Oh, okay. Oh, I have to put the other part on first. So that's what one's gonna look like. So I'm gonna go ahead. But oh, what the hell is this? What is this? Oh God, I can, I didn't even see that. Look at that. Look at how tiny that is. That's just how detailed this game is. Okay, so I'm gonna go on and do the other three and then I'll show you guys how to install that. Okay, so all of them are put together besides the fasteners and now I'll show you guys how to actually put this on. So what's going to happen is you basically just stick it in there, stick it in here, boom, boom, boom. So these are your pistons. So this is a four-cylinder engine. I don't know much about cars, but I know the basics. So now, as you can see, they are sticking through. So one, well, here, I'll show you my flashlight. So one, two. Three and four. So now we have to put each one of these on to keep it fastened, which isn't too, too bad, but it's a little tedious. But what? Torque in three stages. Okay, we're going to do it in one stage, and we're just going to put it up to 50. And uh, if that doesn't work, the game could suck my cock. Seven and eight. Nice. So that's all the parts there. So we can move on to the next one. But uh, I just kind of want to give you guys a little insight as to what the game's like. It's pretty realistic, except for the fact that I can literally fifth. This thing's probably 100 pounds in real life, and I can just whoop. So that's really the only unrealistic thing. But other than that, uh, there's so much more to do. This is literally just the tutorial. You literally build entire cars. So uh, on that note, as I said, it's officially out now. So... It's definitely a lot of fun. I'm not super into cars, but even I found it fun. So on that note, peace, peace, guys. And I'll leave a link in the below for those of you that want to try it out. So laters.